Hello everyone. Whenever we create the HTTP client, there are certain resources which get acquired. And in order to release those resources, we call the dispose method on the HTTP client. This method will release the resources acquired by the HTTP client. Well, there is one more way by which you can do the same thing that is with the help of using statement. So first, let me create a test method. Public void test using statement. Attribute is test method. So the syntax is using open close bracket and then open close curly bracket. So whatever the instance you create here, the scope of this instance will be within these two curly braces. And the moment compiler or you can say the framework encounter the using statement, it will take care of releasing the resources. So you don't need to call the dispose method explicitly. So I'm going to rewrite the same method with the help of using statement. So first we will create the HTTP client. HTTP client equal to new HTTP client. Inside this, I'm going to use one more using statement where I will use the HTTP request message like this. Now the scope of this HTTP client will be available between these two curly braces. And similarly, the scope of this HTTP request message will be available between these two braces. So in both the cases, you don't need to call the dispose method. The framework will take care of it. And rest of the step will remain same. So this is the initialization part where we are creating the instance of HTTP request method and providing the necessary detail. After that, we are executing the request. And again, I will use one more using statement and this will be for the response message. And the remaining piece of code will remain same. So now in this case, when the execution happen, first the dispose method will get called for this instance that is HTTP response message. Then after that, the dispose method will automatically get invoked for HTTP request method. And in the end, it will get invoked for the HTTP client. Okay. So with the help of using statement, you don't need to worry about the handling the resources. Automatically, the dispose method will invoke and the resource will be managed by the framework itself. So just let me build this solution and run the test method. So if you look at the output, it's the same. Now, one more thing which is important, you cannot use any class under the using statement. All those class which has the interface I disposable, only that class can be used inside the using statement. Okay, so that is very important. So that's all for this video and thanks for watching.